Okay, next up we have another one of the seven gods. Yeah, I just did Holte over there. Uh, this is Ebisu-san. He's uh, Ebisu-sama. He's uh, one of the seven Japanese mythological gods, the highly revered Ebisu-san. In fact, there's a beer called Ebisu. That's one of the top ranges. Not really the one I was ever into. Anyways, what is it now? 15 days in training, no booze, just um, New Year's resolutions. How many of you have broken it already? <laughs> okay, now, this is my year. Uh, Ebisu's son. Now, what I did was I measured it um, to the main body um, up to here, which is 40 centi. All right, up to his, his fist there. But if one was to measure overall to his fishing rod, all the way up here, in the right position, you'll find it's uh, 60 centies, uh, all the way up to his, the top of his fishing rod, okay? But I took it from the main body, um, and then I went 40 to there, and uh, what, what was it, 30 wide, I think it was, something like that. Uh, Wrote it all down there. That's wider than that. That's about 34 wide. Cinchies. Uh, down to there. Okay, cookie. Now, this is also bronze. So you can tell if you put a magnet on it, you'll find it doesn't stick. And if it doesn't stick, then you'll find it's either bronze or copper due to its weight, it's bronze. Now, uh, you'll find that this um, fishing rod of his... Oh, Ebisu-san, Sha Sha! He's uh, the god of prosperity and a few other really cool things. And he is just amazingly detailed. And here also, you'll find it's just beautiful. He's fishing rod. He's fishing rod, in fact. Slots in, and then it kind of just slots in. It fits in like that. It fits in beautifully. It tucks in, see? Nice and nice and snug indeed. It's made wonderfully. Um, the maker's mark is back here somewhere. Well, I'll try not to poke my hand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. With that. Uh be careful around um, stupid people and, and young people with this, I would say, um, due to his fishing rod, which is also bronze, um, hanging out like that, yeah? So I would just, I would suggest it, if you're going to place it somewhere, place it against a wall and have the, yeah, you know? I actually bother to care about humanity. What's that? Why? Uh, I don't know. Monkey! <laughs> yes, Buddha. God damn it. Alright. Plus for me. <laughs> look at the. Uh, mate, look at this. Isn't that red? Look at the detail of the scales. I'm going to put this up for a seven day listing. This is just awesome. Now, I'll try not to poke my head with that. As I said, uh, there's a maker's mark down here. So, oh, yeah. Right there. Make it out in the dark. Yeah. So that is just one of the best sculptures you could get. I mean, look at that family crest there. This is great. Fishy's not looking too happy. Uh, yeah. I doubt that. Uh, Old Ebisu san there is a, is a is a vegan. I don't think he look at that all the scales here too. It's all beautifully made. Lovely piece indeed. You are. So again, uh, this one also I will sea freight it. Um, so six weeks to three months takes a long time. Um, but uh, yeah. That's well worth it. I, I, I'll put this up for a seven day listing so you guys can have a fight for it. Um, just a few minutes ago I had a look at my Keitai uh, mobile phone and someone was asking about some kimono material. Um, what a coincidental moment that was because just the other day I was at an auction house and I've got all kinds of stuff. Um, 
And there was uh, a bunch of beautiful kimonos and things. And there's a nice chap there. He said, I think you want, would want these. And he showed me in the box. And he said, might be a good idea if you grab these. Because on the bottom of the box was this. <laughs> it's a, it's a, um, and that, uh, it's a wedding kimono. <laughs> Look at this. It's clean enough, isn't it? Look at this. Oh my. A wedding kimono. It's got a tiny little bit of sort of discoloration. Um, and this is an antique wedding kimono. Look at that. Chirimon. Look at that. Chirimon. Those, those who are in the know of this sort of thing will know what Chirimon is. I'm going to sell them cheap. Um, yeah, that, that's just a heads up. I wanted to give a heads up to that person that was asking about that box. But actually, that box is like crazy cheap. So they, they probably is probably one of these. I think it might be that one. Kimono. My handwriting is just superb. Superb. Uh, finish him. Uh, kimono material. Right there. Um. Yes. So that's just a heads up for you. I'm gonna make another mega box. Get on with it. All right, now. <laughs> it's a gorgeous day. It's the 10th of January. Um, and it's just gorgeous. I've even got some other things over there. Look at that. Beautiful and sunny. Yes. Just good. Right then. I've got another sculpture over there. I've got a, got a cast iron shishi. Um, and I have a bronze shishi over there. Uh, over there. Over there. Over there. We will fight. We will fight. Over there. No wonder they went to war with crap music like that. 